Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to do a requested video. Um, Michelle Krauss had asked me quite a while back um, to compare the two Sista Chic browns. Um, the first one was from her launch collection, and it was called From the Ashes I Rise. And it's a beautiful, beautiful hollow. Gorgeous. And then the second one was from her summer collection. And this one was called Bake. And it was from the sizzle, summer sizzle collection. And it's also got a lot going on in it. I can tell you by first glance at the bottles. They are kind of similar tones, but they're totally different polishes. This one's more of a linear holographic. And this one has more um, iridescent, like, flaky bits or iridescent glitters in it. But I've decided to go ahead and swatch them out on my nails so that you can see the difference. Um, they're both gorgeous polishes and I am really, really excited to do this. As you can see, one's got the swatch dot on top and one doesn't because Mustina is so far behind on her swatching, on her swatch dots. So I'm going to start with the first one, and this one was called From the Ashes I Rise. And we're just going to go in and do a coat of that one on my pointer nail. Oh, bringing back memories here. Gorgeous. This is a beautiful polish. It would be great for fall manis. Of course, you know, I love me some hollow in the fall. And I'm also going to go ahead and do the same color over here on my ring finger so that we can, you know, get some sandwiching going on and you can see the polishes beside each other really well. So that is the first coat of From the Ashes I'll Rise. And now we're going to go on to Baked. Now Baked to me also looks a little more rosy. If that's if that <laughs> it makes any sense at all, and like I said, it's got those iridescent glitters in it. There, uh, I, there might be some hollow in there too. You know, I'm terrible at describing things, but we're gonna get that first coat on there, and these do build up. So, just we're not gonna pass no judgments just yet. <clears throat> get Woody out here because I've made a mess. And then I'm also going to put Baked on my pinky nail. Oh, wow. It's just got the rainbow in it. It was so perfectly named. <laughs> so there we go with those two. I'm going to dial you in just a little bit so you can see. I don't want to dial in too much because my camera gets crazy. But they are definitely different. So we're going to go in real quick. I think I've given that plenty of time to dry. And we're going to go back in with a second coat of From the Ashes I Rise. Loving the formula on this. Gorgeous. Oh my goodness. You know, I have so many polishes that it's hard for me to work my way back to ones I really want to use. And it's because I'm trying to I'm trying to focus on using ones I've never used, and so it's it's easy to put these back in the container and forget how gorgeous. <laughs> I do this with a lot of polishes because I'm a junkie. I keep buying, and I can't wear it fast enough. But here we go with the second coat of Baked. And I do love getting requests. Don't... um you know, don't stop doing that. I, I, I really do love getting them and being able to, you know, show y'all what you're asking for. Uh, it just sometimes might take me a while to get to them. I do write things down so that I don't forget. So there we go with the second coat of Baked. And you can see, hopefully you can see, my camera's playing nice and you can see the difference. I'm going to let these dry for just a few, and I'm going to put some top coat on them, and we're going to do one more peaky C. I'll be right back. Alrighty, I am back there top coated, and I hope that you can see the difference in these. It's so hard to capture 
subtle differences like this. Um, to me, in real life, it's not very subtle. Um, these are definitely, these, the pinky and the middle fingernail are definitely more rosy colored, and these are more brown with definite hollow. Um, you've got the linear hollow and the scattered hollow jumping out. And then these have more like iridescent glitters. So there we go. I hope you enjoyed this one. Michelle, thanks again for the request, and I hope this um, answered your question uh, or, you know, your request. <laughs> and that is it. That is all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed this. Go check out Sister Chicks, Sister Sheiks, excuse me, website. I will have it linked down below. She has new collections coming out very soon, and you might be able to pick up some of these older goodies also that are not really that old. Um, but I will leave a link for them down below. Thank you for watching, and until next time, be good to yourself. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.